I'm Corey Duke from Two Works For You. Here are today's top stories. Democratic presidential candidate Beto O'Rourke is continuing his two-day campaign stop in Oklahoma. This morning, O'Rourke visited Black Wall Street in the Greenwood District here in Tulsa to pay respects to those who lost their lives in the Tulsa race massacre. O'Rourke held a town hall last night at Welltown Brewing, where he discussed overcoming acts of domestic terrorism and the recent string of mass shootings in America. Meanwhile, presidential candidate and Senator Cory Booker will be in Tulsa next week to speak at Tulsa's historic Vernon AME Church in the Greenwood District. An organization which advocates for abused and neglected children is in crucial need for more volunteers. Right now, CASA has more cases than volunteers, which is why they're hoping to sign up about 50 more people. CASA is an organization that trains volunteers to speak up for abused or neglected children who have been placed in foster care. If you're interested in becoming a volunteer, CASA workers will be meeting at the break in Muskogee next Tuesday, August 27th from 9 until 10 a.m. And thousands of college students across the state are getting ready to start the new semester. Several of those universities starting school today are located right here in Green Country, including Oklahoma State University's Tulsa campus, as well as the main campus in Stillwater. Rogers State University is also heading back today, along with all four of Northeastern State's campuses. Meanwhile, the University of Tulsa doesn't start the fall semester until next Monday. Now let's get a check of the forecast with meteorologist Kerrigan Chauvin. Well, all of eastern Oklahoma is battling the heat today. You're either in a heat advisory or an excessive heat warning like the K most of the KJRH viewing area. Heat index is going to range from 105 to 115 this afternoon. Tulsa already sitting at 108 degree heat index. Highs are rising into those upper 90s. Going to be a very warm afternoon. And as you are heading out to pick the kids up after school, expect them to be asking for you to blast the heat. We are looking at temperatures around 96 by 3 p.m by 98 degrees uh, at 4 p.m. this afternoon. Corey? All right, thanks, Kerrigan. That was our digital news update. Keep checking back for updates throughout the day. I'm Corey Duke. Two works for you.